Hello everyone. So in this video, I am going to discuss one of the important question from the topic exception handling. Okay. So this question I have faced recently in one of the interview. Okay. So the question is, if we use system dot exit of zero in try block, so will the finally block will be executed or not? Okay. So let's start. So I am writing one try block that I am printing as try block. Now one catch block I am writing in catch I am printing as catch block okay and now one finally block in finally I am writing as finally block okay so if I run this program the expected output is try block and then finally right yes we are getting the expected output now if i use system dot exit function and the status as uh, status code as zero so now the finally block will be executed or not okay so this was the question so this is very important question that system if we use system dot exit finally block will not be executed because finally block will not be executed because system dot exit is used to terminate the JVM right it is used basically to terminate the Java virtual machine okay and the status code I have used this status code right as zero so this status code this status code zero represents the normal term okay and status code other than zero it can be minus one or one that represents abnormal termination right okay so system dot exit is a function which is used to terminate the java virtual machine so once we have system dot exit in our method other steps cannot be uh, executed okay so this is how we can skip the execution of finally block right and zero represents the normal termination and the value other than zero it can be minus one or one that represents abnormal termination okay right so now the output should be only try block finally block should not be executed right we are getting the output as try block okay so this is one of the important question will face so i thought of uh, making a video on that right okay we'll catch you on the next video right thank you